Welcome to this event. Are you excited to be here? Oh, yes, I'm extremely excited. This is my second year as I was one of the 10 shades last year, so I'm excited. Hey, so excited to be here. How about you? I'm delighted to be here. This is an incredible event. It happens every time in Dallas to be the host with Fred Thomas tonight. I think we're going to have some fun and most importantly, we're going to raise money for a phenomenal cause. Did you see yourselves getting to this level? No, I really didn't and I had an awe moment earlier. I was seeing them transform the room and I was nearly in tears because my mom passed the first year I did Shades of Success and I knew she would be proud and she would be all of this. for all the nine women, uh, the other nine women who are receiving an award here today because I think it's really fantastic and I'm just in awe really. So what does it feel like to be here now several years later after initiating this? It's been a blessing actually because this is the third year and it seems like every year something grows and we're blessed with knowing and getting the network with more and more beautiful women and that's in our community that looks like us that's a part of us. Obviously you're being honored for your courage and leadership and having transitioned into your own space. Yes. So how did you get there? Oh wow, about three years ago I made the leap. I'm a former school principal so I made the leap from the principalship uh, into the entrepreneurial space. It's always amazing to be surrounded around positive, influential, supportive women. I feel good. It's your courage and leadership that has brought you here. So how did you transition into that space? What would you tell the next young lady out there that's looking at you right now? Oh wow, what I can tell the next le young lady is to go after everything that they can get. And always be a student, always be willing to learn. Because you never know who's watching you. And the beauty of the 10 states of success is that they are, they are spotlighting a lot of different women doing a lot of different causes. So you know what, you may not start an, start an organization, but you can become a part of somebody else's. And that's what this is, it brings about sisterhood. And that's so important in our, in our world today. It's, you know, I consider it a privilege to be able to get to do this work, to help women and children who are escaping violence. People ask me all the time, is it hard? Are you sad? And there's so much courage and hope that is one of the most positive uh, things that I've ever done. So I get to do this work uh, and I'm blessed to do it. Extremely excited to be here. It's such an honor and such a wonderful group of people. So it is it is exciting and it was actually the nomination was uh, such a surprise to me. Are you excited really? to be here? So excited. I don't, I can't remember the last time I was, I got all dressed up for something concerning me, you know? It's always somebody else, but yes, I'm really excited. Hi Angie. Hi, how are you? Are you excited to be here? I am super excited. It's been a long time coming. We've been waiting forever for this night and it's finally here. So just blessed to be here. 